Hey guys, iTunes Apps here, and today I'm going to show you how to get the Mac cursor, the one that is black that I'm using right here, and how to get everything else that's on a Mac for the cursor. Just to let you guys know, this isn't a Mac computer. This is a Windows computer, and the brand is Acer, so it doesn't look like a Mac at all, just the theme and stuff. So let's get started. So what you first want to do is go into your uh, internet browser and you want to go to Google right? and then you know, once, this, once this loads up you want to type in Mac cursors or PC and the first link should be WinMatrix go ahead and click on that that to load up and uh, right where it says shind or something see download and it says mac os x cursor.zip go ahead and click on that and it'll open a new window well let's scratch that so sorry about that you don't want to go there what you want to do is where it says full version right up the top. You want to click on this Mac OS X cursors for Windows uh, for Windows XP. It works with Vista also. So it's that load. All right. So you want to scroll down just a little bit. Again, we're right here where it says Shind or whatever. Scroll down until it says. Download Mac OS X cursors.zip. Actually, this one where it says attached files. Sorry, you guys. Go ahead and download this one. Alright, so it should come up and then you should save it or you can open it, save it wherever. I already did this, so I'll go ahead and cancel that. And then, um, And once it's finished downloading, go ahead and uh, open that. And go ahead and extract it all. So if you want it, and it should open up the folder. So I'll click on this. And here's all the um, cursors for the Mac. And you can exit out of that. And all you want to do is go to uh, Control Panel. Uh, the classic view, and then go to mouse, and where it says pointers, open that, and here's all the uh, the default one that you can change. So you want to highlight one, normal select, and then go to browse, and then find where you saved that. All right, so once you find the uh, folder, go ahead and open that up, and now you highlight a normal select and go ahead and find the one that says normal select um, right here. Go ahead and open that. And what I did, I just did that for all of them because uh, all the names are there. And then you can go ahead and hit apply and then OK. And that should change your Mac cursor to the, or not your Mac, your uh, Windows cursor into a Mac cursor. And I have everything now, so when you right click, it should bring that little uh, spinny wheel thing that's like different colors and we should have a black one now and let's see if I can find one no I don't know but um yeah that is it you guys that's how to change your windows cursor into a Mac cursor and this is iTunes apps here check out more videos and make sure you subscribe thanks